Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Danielle here. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a get thick during quarantine workout. So first, I wanna show you guys the smoothie that I've been loving at the moment. It is the Bless Protein in Strawberry Milk. And I love this protein because not only is it made out of plant-based protein, so it's 100% vegan, but it has 23 grams of protein. It's also really smooth and really creamy and it's not too sweet which is what i love normally i have that every morning with water and some ice cubes and it's perfect but for today's video i'm going to be making it into a smoothie i have this here of course this is the star of the show the strawberry milk protein which i know that right now it's sold out on the website so i'm sorry about that but hopefully they restock soon i'm also going to be putting in this almond milk this is unsweetened vanilla almond milk and then i have organic sliced strawberries so i have some of this to just enhance the strawberry flavor so i'm going to blend that all up and then i'm going to show you guys also a quick breakfast idea that you can make but first let's blend up the smoothie and i'm going to put it in this mason jar here This is literally the best vegan protein that I've ever had in my life. And I've tried a couple of proteins like Orgain and some other type of stuff, but this, this is the best. And now guys, I'm going to show you the perfect quick high carb breakfast. This is a meal for you guys who don't like to spend so much time in the kitchen in the morning. Have your protein shake and then have this. So I'm going to show you guys what it is because I prepared it yesterday. I'm a down south with a west coast vibe Keep the vans on when I slide Still bangs grow when I ride Palm trees when I walk outside I'm a down south with a west coast vibe First off we're doing hip thrusts So for that you're gonna need 10 pound dumbbells Or lighter or heavier Whatever you prefer You can do however many sets you want Honestly during this quarantine We clearly don't have access to super heavy weights Unless you were prepared long time ago and you have a bunch of home gym equipment but if you don't you just have to do high reps so high reps with light weight it's pretty much all that we can do so we have to make the best of it so i just did 50 reps right now of the hip thrust and i'm going to do 50 more right now when i slide still bang screw when i ride when i walk outside I'm a gonna do single legged hip thrust now this is really good if you have any glute imbalances or you just feel like one glute is, is stronger the if you feel like one glute is stronger than the other 
that is what i like to use the one legged hip thrust for i feel like my left glute is really stronger and more developed than my right my right is really weak for some reason and it doesn't get activated as much Down south, I had it popping, popping. Shawty said she's staying up in the hole. She don't need me no more. I'ma teach her something that she don't know. I'ma come through, baby, solo. Are you up for this? I'm just trying to cross it off my bucket list. Since she from Atlanta, cause she just moved. Leave me out of the high, said, boy, you smooth. Yeah. I'm down south with a West Coast vibe. Keep the vans on when I slide. Still bang screw when I ride. Palm trees when I walk outside. I'm a down south with a West Coast vibe. Keep them vans on when I slide. Still bang screw when I ride. When I walk outside. I'm a down south with a West Coast vibe. No, I don't got Now for the side glutes, I have lying side leg raises on my list as well as fire hydrants. So, first we're gonna do the lying leg raises and then we're gonna do the fire hydrants here we go for the leg raises you do want to have um a dumbbell at least or you can also use ankle weights i have these gold gym ankle weights they are 2.5 um, pounds i believe not that much but you can even get them at walmart for like up to 10 pounds i'm actually going to use the 10 pounds as well as the ankle weight because i want to make it a bit extra challenging for me fire hydrants same thing either use you know the ankle weights or you can just use a 10 pound dumbbell I like the 10 pound dumbbell is a little bit uncomfortable because it could slip off and fall you pick which one um, with the ankle weights is not as challenging if you do high reps you'll still get you know a little bit of a pump so stick with me and no I'm not showing you um, all of the sets that I do because I feel like that would be so boring and this video would be really long so yeah i'll leave the sets that i do down below or in the video On the list I have donkey kick so this is gonna be good for the upper shelf um, of the booty so I have that and then we're gonna do some lunges and then single leg deadlift so I'm already dead but we're gonna keep pushing through I'm definitely getting super sweaty as you can tell I did my hair the other day it's already like getting all messed up but it's okay so we're growing the glutes
I'm a down south with a west coast vibe Keep the vans on when I slide Still bang screw when I ride Palm trees when I walk outside I'm a down south with a west coast vibe Keep the vans on when I slide Still bang screw when I ride When I walk outside I'm a down Down south, I had it poppin', poppin'. Shawty said she's staying up in no She don't need me no more. I'ma teach her something that she don't know. I'ma come through, baby, solo. Are you up for this? I'm just tryna cross it off my bucket list. Said she from Atlanta, cause she just moved. Keep me out of the eye, said, boy, you smooth. Yeah. I'm a down south with a West Coast vibe. Keep the vans on when I slide. Still bang screw when I ride. Palm trees when I last two exercises which are gonna be the lunges and then the single leg deadlift so I am gonna be wearing my little ankle weights um, and I'm gonna be using a 10 pound dumbbell I'm a down south with a west coast vibe keep the vans on when I slide still bang screw when I ride when I walk outside I'm a Although we are in quarantine, they don't let this be a time where you slip. Use everything that's going on as fuel for you to just better yourself. And once this is all over, you know, you don't want to feel behind. You just want to be able to be proud of yourself and know that you've been consistent and you've been disciplined, especially when things get really rough like they are now. Write down all of your goals, okay? I have lots of little post-it stuff and I have my little pen. I could have been lazy today, right? But instead, I decided to write out what are my goals, okay? Social media goals, things that I want to post and then even stuff that I want to post on my YouTube channel. So this video that you're watching right now, I actually like planned it all out. So get yourself a little pen and paper, get yourself some sticky notes and write out your goals so you don't slack on them. I'm a down south with a west coast vibe Keep the vans on when I slide Still bang screw when I ride Palm trees when I walk outside I'm a down south with a west coast vibe Keep the vans on when I slide Still bang screw when I ride When I walk outside I'm a down so that is the workout i hope you guys enjoyed i am like so sweaty like literally we are getting our booty goals okay during quarantine we are still making gains at home so now i'm going to show you guys the meal portion of this so i'm going to show you guys a high carb high protein dinner or lunch that you can have that it's really quick 
and easy and I'm so sorry I'm out of breath I am like sweating like crazy but um yeah also if you saw my hair up and down in some parts of the video it's because I kept on debating between trying to look cute and trying to be serious but yeah my hair is all over the place in this video don't mind it obviously yes I work out with my hair up majority of the time but you know having your hair down it gets more views let's just be honest it does but anyways guys let's go and eat because I am starving Guys, a snack this is a Lenny and Larry's cookie look it seems pretty natural to me it's vegan and it's high protein so this is a really good flavor I also like there's like a lemon poppy that's also one of my favorite flavors yeah, now I'm gonna show you guys my high carb high protein lunch slash dinner I guess you could say and yeah I will show you guys what I'm working with. The original recipe I was going to show you was with the bonza pasta, just 23 grams of protein in 3.5 ounces, which is half a cup, about half a cup, a little less than half a cup. 23 grams of protein, not bad at all. And I was going to say to have it with the tuna, but I know some people might think tuna is disgusting, might not like tuna, but it's 15 grams of protein in one can of this tuna so 38 grams of protein already which is pretty good for one meal and then what would the carbs be on this carbs would be 56 which I think is pretty good I mean you could always bulk it up and add more than the serving size for right now because I'm really tired and it's later in the day and I didn't actually make my meal as early as I thought I was gonna make it so I'm like super starving and hungry but since I'm being lazy, I'm gonna have this turkey kalbaza. You know, Hillshire farm meat is like really not good for you. And I know it's ironic because I'm showing a vegan protein powder and I'm having meat. But look, I'm doing my best, okay? I'm not vegan by any means. I try to not have milk, but I do have cheese. So... Eventually, I would like to become more plant-based because I know it's healthier for me, but for right now, this is what I'm having because it's quick and it's easy. Don't come for me in the comments about how unhealthy it is because I know, but sometimes you have to work with what you have. for watching this video please be sure to subscribe and give it a thumbs up if you like the video and if you want more content like this I want to know what you guys want to see do you want to see more life advice videos beauty fitness or do you want to see all of it because honestly I plan on doing everything on my channel but it's just always good to know what you guys want to see so thank you guys for working out with me during this quarantine situation. I want you guys to keep your vibes very high, very positive, and just, you know, we're going to get through this. We're all in this together, guys, but we are going to make it out. We're going to make it with some gains, okay? We're going to have accomplished our goals, and we're not being lazy during this quarantine. Getting slim, thicky, you know what I mean? We're losing weight. If losing weight is what you want to do, for me, I'm gaining weight, so that's what I want to do. But yeah, I'm just feeling very good, feeling very spiritually uplifted during this time because I've been meditating every day, I've been praying because I believe in God, it's not what you have to believe in, I'm just saying. I've been praying every day um, and just focusing on my goals and it's honestly been helping me and it's been helping my mental state and that's what I've been doing. So I am sending you guys so much love and positive vibes and yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you and thank you for your support. And I will see you guys in my next video, which is going to be a life advice video. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.